Where are you? The committee will be here soon. We need to run an equipment check. I'm almost there. Blocks away. Uh, guess I'll just do it myself. No, don't. It's not safe. Uh. Gotta love Doc's enthusiasm, but sometimes it gets him into trouble. Better get there before he hurts himself. I'm sorry I'm late. started without me. The Grant Committee's director will be here soon. It's fine, Parker. I invented this equipment. I think I can handle it. Power damper. Oh, man. Um, maybe we should abort. Not yet. Hold on! Ah, Dr. Octavius, are you okay? <coughs> Another setback. <coughs> but we're close. Is anyone hurt? No, it, it, it was all the, my fault. The energy levels exceeded our expectations. From a certain viewpoint, that's a very positive development. It doesn't smell very positive. I assure you, in the next phase... Let's not get ahead of ourselves. <coughs> Is there somewhere else we can discuss this? Maybe you should take the rest of the day off, Peter. But we'll talk later. was a disaster. How could the dampener have failed? I know Doc said take the day off, but I have to figure out what went wrong. Oh, you are in bad shape, little guy. Doc's been testing new materials for the prosthetics. He asked me to review his work if I had time. May as well dig in now. We're trying to improve the prosthetics hardware. I should review what Doc's been developing and double check his work. Today's the day. Grant review. We're ready. The work has progressed at a remarkable pace. I honestly never thought we'd get the tensile actuator back to an acceptable tolerance. But Parker. The boy has an eye for guerrilla science like none other. Just as I was ready to order a custom machine replacement part, he returned from the hardware store with a bottle of solvent and a toothbrush. Bang! Actuator problem resolved. The boy is a genius. <sighs> a chronically late genius. It's already ten after. Where is he? Doc was testing a new contact material for the prosthetic.
hydrogel polymer composite. Strong, but there's a lot of impedance. Better tell Doc to keep looking for other materials. All right. I should get out of here before I screw things up for Doc even more. Spider-Man, it's Yuri. Fisk make it to Rikers yet? Not Rikers. Our boy qualifies for the VIP treatment. He's in the raft. Ah, joining Scorpion, Electro, and the rest. Fisk should be honored. That's a steam company. Can you swing by the precinct? Got an issue that could benefit from your unique skill set. For you, Yuri? Anything. I'm on my way. Huh. Looks like Jameson's got a new episode out. Wonder what my number one fan thinks about the Fisk takedown. This is Just the Facts with J. Jonah Jameson, where listeners like you discuss the issues affecting our city with Pulitzer Prize winning two times. Two times. Pulitzer Prize winning former publisher of the Daily Bugle. Hey, plug the book. And, and as always, if you order Mr. Jameson's book, Spider-Man, Threat or Menace, within 24 hours of our broadcast, you'll get an autographed copy at no extra charge. No personalizations, don't ask, not gonna get it. Welcome to Just the Facts with J. Jonah Jameson, alerting you to the threats you don't even know about. Let's dive right into the calls. Speak. Okay, so not for nothing, you gotta give Spider-Man respect for taking down Wilson Fisk, right? I mean, one last mob boss is good for everyone. Is that right? Tell me, are you a police officer? Prosecutor? Maybe an award-winning reporter with decades on the job like me? Uh, no. I'm a plumber. Oh, good. Then fix my toilet and shut up! Let me explain something to you about crime. As soon as one goes down, every punk with a gun, a tracksuit, and a drawer full of gold chains decides he's the next godfather. We're gonna have a gang war in the streets, but does that whip-headed moron give a damn? Of course not. He got on TV. That's what counts. <laughs> yeah, well, I can get copper pipe without paying kickback. So until that gang war starts, I'm on the webhead side. And you'll be singing a different tune when three new mobs are lining up to charge you triple for that same pipe. Or just break your legs. Come on! <sighs> Someday, Jonah. Let me get you to say something nice about me. Someday. Now that you quit smoking, what do you tell people when you come up here? That I need a break from their crap. Fair enough. So, why'd you call? Need a date to the policeman's ball? You got a black and white suit? Uh... No ball this year anyway. We spent too much integrating Oscorp surveillance tech. Worth it though, right? It was. Till an hour ago. The system went down. Citywide. Every tower. How? They tell me someone sabotaged the central server, and now all the towers are offline. Hmm. Inside job? Maybe. I'll figure it out later. Right now, we need to get the towers back online. Fast. And you called me? Aw, that's sweet. I called someone I could trust. Plus, the signals are scrambled, and we have no idea how to fix it. Ooh. I love a challenge. You break it, you buy it. I thought you trusted me. Let's take a look at this tower. Input bands have been shifted. Subtle. Thanks for the heads up. 1182 
any available units, 1182 along the northbound side of the Brooklyn Queens Expressway near Atlantic Avenue. Please respond to 2. Got an 1165 on the eastbound side of the Manhattan Bridge. It's We just had a tower come back online. Was that you? Not just a pretty mask, huh? Whatever you did, any chance you could do it to the other towers? Sure, but just so you know, I had to sync up with the tower to fix it. I'm seeing all crime data in the area now. Looks like there's a break-in happening near me. Great. I've got units nearby. Don't bother. I'm on it. Sure, these guys didn't forget their keys. How are we supposed to find them up there? Huh? You. You're done, freak. Okay, wrapped up. Thanks for that. Now I'm seeing an assault near you. You're in luck, Yuri. Your favorite tough but lovable grizzled seen too much detective is in town. What? No, 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 no. You promised you wouldn't do that any- Spider cop. Please, no. You're the snitch. Back off, creep. Yep, she's the one. I said back off! Leave me alone! Keep me quiet. Get away from her! Walk away now, or she's dead! Let me go! All clear, ma'am. I knew Jameson was wrong about you. You're a little weird, but you got a good heart. Have you got somewhere to go? I can take care of myself. I I'm sure you can, but just in case, there's a place called the Feast Center. Seen it. I don't want charity. They got the best wheat cakes in the city, hands down. Mom used to make those. Haven't had any in a long time. I'll check it out. Thanks, Spider Guy. It's Spider Man. Oh well. Should be able to spot the next tower from up there. From his elevated position, Spider Cop spies his destination. A second surveillance tower. Are you... narrating yourself? What? No! Of course not! 
Chief never did understand Spider Cop. Thought he was a loose cannon. Already regretting this. I can modify these towers to track more than just crimes. Score. Towers are picking up all kinds of RFID signals now, including one nearby. What is that? Backpacks from high school. Forgot I attached tracking dots to these. Wonder how many of these are scattered around the city. Still there? Got a robbery a few blocks away. Spider cops on it. Part man, part spider, all cop. Ugh. Open the safe. Do it. Hey, fellas. Ah! Spider Man, shoot him. Legit job, you wouldn't need to be criminals. You're gonna regret this, Spider Freak. <laughs> All right, Yuri, I'm gonna repair the last Chinatown tower now. Don't you mean Spider Cop's gonna repair it? Been doing a little thinking, Yuri. Policing's a young man's game, and Spider Cop, well, he's no spring chicken. Please be going where I think you're going. As of today, Spider Cop is officially retired. Oh, thank God. I need a drink. We'll all drink tonight, Yuri. Drink to the memory of Spider Cop's tireless... Yuri? Yuri, you there? I guess the emotion of the moment overwhelmed her. Our way over from 
Not good. Can't have people taking pictures of my three chest hairs. Tools I need for suit repair at the lab. Wonder if Dr. Octavius is left for the day. Doctor, how did it go with the committee? I'm so sorry I screwed things up. Not at all, Peter. They're just nervous in the face of imminent triumph. They'll calm down. They always do. Should I head back to the lab for cleanup? No, no. I'm stepping out for dinner anyhow. We'll resume tomorrow. Short break, then back to creating the future. Wish I could bottle and sell that man's optimism. Sounds like he's left the lab for the day. Good time to work on my suit in private. Looks like Doc's gone for the night. Time to sneak in some spider work. Doc's made huge breakthroughs his whole career, but he's always been upstaged, usually by Oscorp. This time, it's going to be different. Parker, Dr. Octavius, I, uh, what you got there? Chinese. If I know you'd be here, I would've... What are you working on? Oh, just a side project. <sighs> of course. It's you. I, uh, I, I don't know what oh, you're... Oh, come on, Parker, it's obvious. L -l Let me explain. I only wish you'd told me sooner. I wanted to. I was afraid that if word got out, my family might be in danger. Huh. Yes. Uh, I guess if you design his equipment, you're bound to be a target too. Yeah. Um, yeah. Don't worry. Your secret's safe. Well, I'll leave you to it. Check your email. Hope this isn't how Doc fires me. Peter, the revelation of your second job as Spider-Man suit crafter, is that the right term? <clears throat> is a reminder of the good man and partner you are. No matter how hard you work, you still find time to help others. I hope you don't mind, but I noticed the suit was a bit damaged, and I took the liberty of sketching up some of my own improvements. Attached are a few ideas I had on how you could enhance his suit and help protect Spider-Man, who does so much for this city. Looking forward to the incredible work that we are doing and changing the world together. Your partner and friend, Otto. White Spider, huh? Hmm... That should do it.
Same old me. Spider-Man, I think I figured out how Fisk's men are keeping his rackets running. Construction site. Wasn't that shut down when he was arrested? No, it's one of his legitimate businesses. Multiple investors. We can't act without cause. But now you've got that, right? That's why I'm hoping you can keep an eye on the locations. Tell me if you see anything suspicious. You got it. I'll be your nosy neighborhood Spider-Man. following a severe accident. Location is north of Houston. Over. My loyal listeners, Brush heads, they call themselves, though I've uh, never quite understood why. Will remember my warnings about the downright Orwellian crime monitoring system the city was installing. Well, it's not operating. Why, you ask? Because someone came to their senses and realized they'd be violating civil liberties? Wrong! Because those incompetent bureaucrats built a network that crashes more often than a wino driving a bumper car. So your tax dollars got wasted, and there's nothing to show for it. It's about as close as you get to a happy ending in the real world, kids. Possible narcotic sale reported. Nearest unit, please respond. Yuri, I'm at a Fisk construction site, and there's a lot of guys here who aren't exactly constructing. What are they doing? I'm gonna go find out. This looks like it could work. Hmm. Let's see. I can't read this. Should've brought my glasses. Awesome. Doc could be proud. I know, but I remember when he was a punk kid and the boss used to hand him his ass on the regular. I thought the boss killed him that one time. Maybe he did. Lenny says there's more than one Spider-Man. Bite your tongue. That's all we need, an army of Spider-Men. You guys are new here. Decided to stop off for a drink on the way to a delivery. That was his last delivery. You know what I mean? We get paid well. Anyone's there? Show your car. I saw you. Get it off. It's him. I'm gonna crush your skull. <laughs> Lucky shot. You don't mess with the kingpin and live. <laughs> Time to end this. More of them. Spider-Man, turns out we've busted four illegal firearms dealers within a three-block radius of that site. Gun running. Let's see what I can do to cut down the supply. 
Dang, looks like they called their buddies. Socks, in which case, buy some socks already. Oh, you just made a big mistake.
Place is locked down, Captain. Actually, webbed down. And someone finally reported shots fired, so I've got officers inbound. Good work. Fisk has more construction sites throughout the city, betting their fronts, too. Keep an eye out, and report in if you see anything suspicious. If I'm gonna find all of Fisk's construction sites, I should recalibrate my mapping software to be more accurate. Using a depth map post process on photos of popular landmarks should do it. And I know just the one to start with. Change the world, Doc. I'll settle for not starting any more fires. See you tomorrow, Peter. Here's to a successful day. Good old Empire State. Man, I love this town. Time to grab a snapshot. That'll do it. Map should be recalibrated now. I haven't done much photography since quitting the Bugle. Forgot how much I enjoy it. Should keep an eye out for more landmarks to shoot. Mr. Lee. Hello? Peter, it's Martin Lee. I just wanted to let you know we need a little extra time to get set for May's party. I guess the cake delivery is stuck in traffic. Oh, sure thing. Uh, just let me know when you're ready and I'll swing by. Great. Talk to you soon. Okay, we've got some time to kill. 
Let's see what's happening out in the city. Mr. Lee's probably in the kitchen getting ready for the party. Hey guys, how's the game going? How's it look like it's going? I'm winning. Get this guy checked for dementia, Pete. I'm crushing him. Well, the important thing is having fun. <laughs> I have a lot of fun whooping his ass. And your dreams, crazy lady. Want a game, Pete? We play for peanuts. No, 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 no. Too rich for my blood. I'll leave you to it. Think of what you want. Hey, Peter. <laughs> What's up? Just However, dropping in. Hey, Martin. So sorry I'm late. You were right on time. Just keep her distracted while we get everything ready. You got it. Hey, there's my favorite aunt. Peter, what a nice surprise. Need some help? Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, there are some heavy no, boxes. No, no, no. I mean, I mean, I mean, not yet. I mean, I came to, uh, uh, uh I just, just wanted to talk. Okay. Okay. Come on. Um. Peter, are you in trouble? Do you need money? No, no I, mean, I mean, I'm a little behind on my rent, but no, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Girl problems again, huh? What? No, that's crazy. I still wish you and MJ could work things out. She's a great girl. She is, but... The two of you would make some beautiful wow. baby. Uh... Peter. What is it? Come on, you can tell me. These past few years... You helping me through college and working here, and sacrificing so much and asking for nothing. I just wish there were more people like you in the world. He's right. Five years ago, you walked in here and told me you were inspired by my mission to help others. Now it's you who inspires me. Thank you, May, for everything. Here's to many more years of service. Thanks again for setting all this up. No, oh, I just wish I could do more. Well, May's always told me if you help someone... You help everyone. <laughs> yeah, maybe we should send May to City Hall to have a word with the mayor. Oh, I gotta run. Um, thanks again for the party and everything. It, it really means a lot.
Voicemail from Yuri. Should check it outside. Hi, Pete. Your aunt's in the back, I think. Voicemail from Yuri. Hey, silent alarm at the auction house holding Fisk's estate sale just tripped. Could you check it out? Quietly? I don't want to make a scene if it's nothing. Fisk estate sale? Sounds fun. Wonder what the kingpin had hidden in his closets. <laughs> 